uh, just not a heads up on some errors that occur in the loop. Um, one of them I see occurring a lot is the runtime error. And that occurs when the repeat is not placed in the specific spot that the user wanted to be. Now, it's not that it's wrong, it's just that the place that it's being that is being placed is not where the user wants it to be for the output to be in a specific way. Now that might sound a bit confusing, a lot confusing, but I'll show you what I mean. So the repeat is up there and sometimes it can be probably down here or well it does not it doesn't necessarily have to be there but it can be somewhere else. So when once it's down there you can do compile and you can see compile successful. So you can see that it's not that it's wrong, it's just that it's not placed where the user wants it to be. Now run, yes, and we get Merry Christmas to you, so that works, and no. And oh my gosh, we're going to get a runtime error, what happened there? Yes, runtime error. So we can come back here now, and I can show you why that happened. Now, repeat. as you what just happened is because of this else repeat so this just repeats over and over again until a equal yes but how can a be equal to yes if it's not even asking us the input for a so that's what i said that is pretty tricky so what has to happen here is that the repeat can be there it continues it continues to go like that because there is no read at the bottom there for it to repeat and actually stop at intervals for you to input what a is supposed to be so there is no chance for a e even being equal to yes so what has to happen is that it has to be from there and put it at the top there so everything is repeated and not just this little section here uh, that was just not a heads up. Thanks for watching, y'all.